This was because it was a 50 year, 50 million euro uh, fossil that they found, and uh, they're trying to kind of find out a little bit of history behind it and try to find out the sediment that's around the rocks and what have you and see what type of uh, bony structure that the uh, specimen had. Uh, these are the diagnostic characters that are used to define several groups of, of snakes. So I hope to find these characters in order to know in a better way um, where this snake fit in the phylogeny of snakes. something here that I need to look at the fossil and, and, and try to find out what it is. In the middle Cretaceous we know that there, that there are several snakes with well-developed hind limbs. We still have hind limbs. So uh, we were thinking about if if this snake would have also hind limbs, since the Eocene is, is quite old, but it doesn't seem to have, and and the CT scan just confirms us this, which is neat, which is important. So we know now that uh, it's it's a snake that is much more derived, much more evolved than previously thought. So it puts it a little farther down the timeline. Puts a little farther up in in the in the phylogeny in the history of snakes, although it's a little um, or it's it's old, although it's old.